Hi everyone, um, I'm here just to share some of my latest finds with you. I have some lovely cigar boxes and also um, a cigar cutter. The cigar cutter is quite heavy. It looks to be leather on the top and then it has a gold brass type piece around here. It has a V cutter and it sounds quite nice when you cut it. It looks to be very well used, but still in perfect condition. It's not chipped or anything. Um, a very nice piece if you're a collector of cigar accessories. It would look lovely on a desk or, you know, beside an ash tree or wherever. It's really nice. Now, with regards to the boxes, the first box I have here is a Monte Cristo box. It's a lightweight wood. It has um, the official Cuban seal with the hologram there as well. It has a beautiful little catch here which opens up into a beautiful box. Monte Cristo Petit Edmundo. It still has the little paper in it and also the, the paper here as well and some crumbs of cigars by the looks of it. So all in all a very nice box, nice condition, beautiful catch that still works and on the back it does actually say made in Cuba, Hecho in Cuba, um, October 2012 you'll see is on the box also. Okay so on the side of the box it must have been a box of 10 Monte Cristo Petit Edmundo. So it has all the markings of a Cuban box of um, Monte Cristo cigars. So that's box number one. Box number two is very much the same. Um, also has the official seal, Cuban seal and the hologram. The beautiful little catch which works perfectly. Inside Petit Edmundo and it also has a sheet of the original paper there. Nice box. On the side, 10 Monte Cristo Petit Edmundo. Underneath, it actually says September 2015. Again, Hecho on Cuba, made in Cuba. Another lovely little Monte Cristo box. The next one we have here is a bit bigger. It's not made of wood, it's more of a, a card, thick cardboard box, but it's really pretty. It's a Punch Manuel Lopez, RE it says on the front. Um, it has a Cuban seal here, handmade box of 25. I'll turn around the side here, Punch on that side and on the other side much the same. Underneath on the bottom has Made in Cuba. I'm not quite sure if this is the date however you can make your own mind up on that one. Okay so we'll have a quick look inside of this one as well. It opens up nicely. Beautiful picture there of Punch and made in Havana, Cuba. It also has the original leaf paper, which has a picture of, um, well, it says Manuel Lopez, um, which I would imagine would be, um, I don't know what it is, but anyway, we look inside. And it looks as though these cigars were sold for nine, nine euro seventy five here at some point. Beautiful box, nice and colourful, in good condition, closes nicely. And that's box number three. Box number four is a Monte Cristo box. Um, now it has the official seal, Cuban seal, and the hologram. It was a box of it says 20 junior and it says the same around the other side and the back. I'll turn it over now. It looks as though 
the sticker has covered the date but it says July now we'll have a look inside okay that's a beautiful Monte Cristo leaf inside and the back of the box says um, open Havana Cuba <laughs> inside there's actually an empty box of three short Churchills, Romeo and Juliet. It's empty, however, it does have the original seal on with the hologram as well. Okay, so that's a nice wee box there. Box number four. Box number five looks to be pretty much the same. Um, has the original details on. Monte Cristo, Havana, Cuba. Okay, Monte Cristo Habana Cuba open. Still has the original leaf in it. Very nice box again on the back. It looks to have been covered up slightly. May 2010. Made in Cuba. Okay, now the last box is a really nice one. Romeo and Juliet, Havana, made in Havana, Cuba. Again, it looks as though it's had the original um seal on there we'll turn it over february 2008 again very nice box romeo and juliet a box of 10 romeo number one we'll open it up and really nice picture on the the opening side of it it looks as though it's been sold the cigars have been sold for six euro and ten cent at some point still has some paper in the bottom Still has some paper in the bottom but I think that's just um, a covering paper just to, to keep it nice okay so that's a another beautiful box so all in all we have six boxes and a cigar cutter they're all for sale if you're interested in any of them or would like to any further information on them by all means send me a message okay subscribe subscribe so you can see what my next haul is and I look forward to hearing from you. Thanks. Bye-bye.